Grand Canyon Caverns is a private commercial cave located in the northwest part of Arizona, along historic Route 66 between Seligman and Kingman. The cave has been a tourist attraction since the 1920s. The cave moves significant air, and following the air, cavers have recently found hundreds of feet of new passage. To further the exploration and dig following the air, an electric extension cable had been run from an old service drop. With the new finds pushing the limits of the extension cord, a plan was devised to drill an access hole into the new section at the top of a blind dome. This will allow a much shorter run. On February 21st of 2015, Paul Jorgensen and Rich Bowman did a cave radio location of the drill spot. A point on the ceiling was marked as the expected entry point with an X marks the spot. On the surface, the exact center of the beacon signal was located and marked for future drilling. The radio estimated depth to the antenna is 80 feet. After obtaining the required permits and coordinating schedules with the driller, it was finally drilling day on June 8, 2015. The air drill rig is positioned over the spot and set up. The drilling begins to the compact dirt overlaying the limestone. The first 20 feet of the drill hole are in compact dirt, which is collected for later use. After reaching depth, the hole is cased with steel to prevent surface water intrusion into the drilled hole. The dirt collected from the hole is mixed with a fast set concrete which is poured around the casing to lock it into place. While the casing cement was curing, a video camera was set up in the cave to record the final drilling event. After the cavers setting up the camera were safely back on the surface, drilling through the limestone continued. The high pressure air removes the cuttings from the hole into an exhaust away from the drillers. This material is occasionally checked to determine the type of rock being drilled and to see that the right size of rock chips are being created by the drill. A check of the depth so far means that there should only be another 10 feet to the ceiling. That is communicated to the crew so that they can be careful not to bring too much pressure on the ceiling. What does it sound like when a cavity is found? The hammering stops and the air escapes from the bottom of the drill. The in-cave camera captured the drill hammering on the ceiling and dropping rocks off the ceiling. It was a good day to only have a camera in the passage aimed at the expected entry point.
with the sound of the air being released into the passage. The drilling is done, and the 6-inch drill bit appears near the expected entry point. The entire drilled hole is cased with a PVC liner, which sticks down into the passage a couple of feet. The distance between the expected point and the actual drilled point is not very far. Happiness was achieved. The L head cap was attached to the top of the access hole. The heavy duty extension cable wire is run down the hole, supported on a hanger bar. In the future, a dedicated electrical service box will deliver power to the cave. After the drill rig left, it was found that the distance to the actual hole is about the same distance as the offset underground. The technology works.